find a piece of known 18 karat gold, which this band is. So you, you press it on here and it's gonna fall. This is a new pin, so it's not gonna go 18. So you dial it in with this little dial, see here? And you dial this in to the middle of 18. Now you're ready to test. Got it? So you like set the calibration and now yeah. to tell it this is 18. Now it's calibrated. Now it knows. Yeah, now it's okay. ready to go. Got it. So we'll take a ring. Thank you, Miss Amy. 14 karat. Ooh, Whoa, it's really fancy. Oh my God. <laughs> we'll take this ring. I can't see it. Oh, it's 8 karat. No, it's 14 karat. <laughs> <laughs> Now, one of the coolest things like that this here. key tester can do is it can test for a Royal X casing for um, stainless steel, anything 1985 and above. Royal X has its own consistency as far as um, stainless steel. It's called 904L stainless steel. And I'll tell you, when I first got brought this in this morning, it was tested fake. Well, one thing you need to do when you get some, especially if somebody's been wearing one, if you're gonna use this to ground it, you need to take this and scratch it. What that does is it takes all the, the oil and everything else off of it. Similar to like when you're um, testing a ring, the stone or ring, how you need to wipe the stone off to get all the lotion and stuff off, similar to this. So, you put this on here, and then you take the tip off, right Timmy? We've done that before. If you forget to take the tip off, it doesn't work. Go there and see it goes right back. It should go right back here. Now, if you're getting weird readings, then you need to clean it again. Especially the back of a watch, it's the worst. But you can do the, you can do the links the same way. It'll go and they'll go right back. And then also, I mean, you can just keep testing different stuff. This stem should be 18. It goes to 18. And the links are 18. One of the cool things about this is I, it's, I'll have Kyle do it for me, is you can test somebody's watch while it's on. This becomes your grounding plate. Instead of using this, use the two of them. So, so you do the same thing. Just, here you go, it's going to 18. 18. So if you have somebody who has a ring on that they can't get the ring off or they just don't want to take it off, this is how you test with it. It's, it's the best tester out there. It's the most simple tester out there. The biggest problem that we have is clerks leaving the tip off, the cap off. If this cap dries out, it's, it's not, it's not going to work. So be sure that they put the cap back on.